to the SEMA show 2010. I'm Steve Saline, uh, S-A-L-E-E-N, and this is our latest creation, the Steve Saline SMS 302 Mustang. And uh, we've taken, uh, really, from what we've been doing for the last 30 years, every bit of knowledge, and have incorporated it to our latest product. What you see here is a very unique car in the respect that it's uh, it has a completely different suspension for better handling and, uh, and cornering. Of course, here we are at the Pirelli exhibit and it comes with the best tires in the world and those are the Pirelli P0s. We wouldn't use anything else. Um, in addition to that, after we do the suspension, we also do the brakes and it has our own unique brakes on it, both the front and the rear, to give us that extra stopping. We've also, if you look at the vehicle, it does have the similarities of a Mustang, but that's really kind of where it stops. We've actually lengthened the car from an aerodynamic standpoint in our CFD, uh, in the computer and wind tunnel testing, tells us what we need to do to make the car more efficient to go through the air with uh, less drag and more downforce. What we've done is we've actually extended the front of the car an inch and a half. So the front of the car actually is longer than, than what you would see a normal Mustang. We've done that by integrating the front, front fascia, the grille, and we've extended the hood. And part of that aspect of it is we've actually taken the aerodynamics and have squid, squirted it down to, uh, to a smaller area that actually makes less of a hole through the air at speed. Then as you look through it, we've also then have gone through the side skirts. And if you look closer and even underneath it, you can see how we actually channel the air from the, um, away from the rear wheel. It gives us again a better aerodynamic uh, package. Then a trademark that has always been been part of mine. We've also extended about two and a half inches the rear of the car to give us a, a balance between what we've done on the front of the car with the back by adding both a spoiler and a rear wing and extending it about two and a half inches further back to actually make it very effective. And then we've topped it off with a aerodynamic rear diffuser. And this rear diffuser helps clean up the air underneath the car, which gives us really, if you will, the best aerodynamics of any street-going car that you can purchase on today's market. We also have incorporated a little bit from the F1 technology, and that is, is that we have a third brake light. It's actually what we call our rain light. So when you actually step on the brakes, you actually see another central brake light, which gives it a very unique um, appearance, especially at night, which is a lot of fun to drive around because people have no idea what kind of car it is, other than they've seen it on the Formula One. Interior lights. We have, uh, have changed it dramatically. It has basically custom seating, where not only the the leather and the covers have been changed, um, but we've also changed all the foam in it, which actually gives us better seating support for high performance type of ride. And we've used, again, the latest in leathers. We use a complete herd of cows to actually make this, and it has the very suede or the Alcantara as a nice accent. The gauge and the, the mile per hour are recalibrated up to 200 mile, mile per hour. It has a uh, different um, calibration with that. We also have a short throw shifter and different shift knob. Comes complete with floor mats and uh, a lot of uh, unique badging, uh, door sill plates and all of those type of things. Probably though where the biggest change is is under the hood. Up here, we have been able to change the engine. This is the normally aspirated version of it. And what you see here is that um, it has a different uh, air filter, um, different intake, different calibration, and different exhaust. And this allows us to get almost 440 horsepower out of a normally aspirated uh, vehicle. 
We've also strengthened, as you can see from the suspension, with its own strut tower brace and the uh, plates on the top of the uh, struts to give us more rigidity to make sure that we get the most out of those Pirelli tires when we're doing hard cornering or braking. And all of this is available at your local Ford dealer somewhere in the world. We actually sell throughout North America, but we also are now distributing in Japan as well as in Europe. So again, we've been very pleased with this. And uh, if the Mustang version isn't necessarily our cup of tea, we also have the new uh, Dodge Challenger that we're in production with and soon to be with the new Camaro. So I'm sure we have a pony car for you. And they all come equipped with Pirelli tires.